This is really quite simple. When we are stressed, we tend to isolate ourselves and dwell on the problem. Hello everyone. Feeling stressed and overwhelmed is something we almost can't avoid with our current lifestyle. Although certain amount of stress can be good for us, too much stress can cause anxiety and poor health. Being able to cope with stress can help to strike a balance and help maintain our effectiveness and productivity in our day-to-day -day life. Regardless of our current life circumstances, let's look at a handful of things we can do that are proven to help. Numerous studies have proven the benefits of exercising in reducing stress, which includes simple activities such as walking as well as strengthening exercises. Therefore, try to get at least 20 to 30 minutes of physical activity daily. And yes, you can definitely break these 30 minutes to bouts of 10 to 15 minutes two to three times a day. Also remember, outdoor physical activities are much better than indoor activities. Consuming food rich in omega-3 fatty acids help reduce perceived distress symptoms and prevent aggression toward others during times of stress. Besides, eating foods rich in omega-3 fatty acids can reduce inflammation associated with chronic stress. Examples of food high in omega-3 fatty acids are flax seeds, walnuts, chia seeds, mackerel, salmon and cod liver oil. Sleep is so important for our health, but we often overlook at it. Even slight sleep deprivation constantly or poor sleep quality can affect our memory and judgement. In addition, not getting enough sleep can cause a negative mood, low energy and a general inability to function as usual, which can lead to stress. Studies revealed adults who sleep fewer than 8 hours a night report higher stress levels than those who sleep at least 8 hours a night. Many people are resorting to meditation and mindfulness when it comes to dealing with stress. However, a recent study suggests that not all mindfulness practice is equally effective in combating stress. What might be missing in our mindfulness practice is an important element which is acceptance. Mindfulness practices that specifically emphasize acceptance helps develop a non-judgmental attitude toward our experiences. Meaning to say, we do not label our thoughts, feelings or experience as good or bad and trying not to change or resist them in any way. People who learn to accept difficult experience without resisting it become less reactive to stress and in fact become stronger. This is really quite simple. When we are stressed, we tend to isolate ourselves and dwell on the problem. Instead, reaching out to family or friends and making new social connections with others can offer distraction, provide support and help us tolerate life's ups and downs. So instead of locking yourself in the room or house, plan a meetup with a family member or friend. Call up a friend that you have not spoken for some time or visit your place of worship. The habit of constantly checking a smartphone has been associated with rising stress level based on some studies conducted. Both our brain and body needs time to rest and recover from our day at work. Being on 24-7 definitely isn't healthy for our mind, body or spirit. Rather, take some time to reconnect with yourself by unplugging from technology after a specific time. Truly, learning to cope with stress may not be that difficult after all. And as I mentioned earlier, in this current lifestyle, most of us are surely going through some form of stress. At the end of the day, always remember, stress is not what happens to us. It's our response to what happens. A response that we can change at any moment. Hey everyone, if you like today's video, feel free to like and subscribe to my channel so you will not miss my weekly videos where I shall be empowering you to lead a healthy life. You can also follow me on my Facebook or Insta to get daily health tips and recommend to your loved ones as well. Meanwhile, if you have any questions or feedback or even any topics that you would like me to discuss, feel free to type in the comment box. Thank you for watching 